good morning students welcome all to this online class we are almost completing the portion for semester 1 in this regard today we'll complete the book exercise of chapter 3 regarding question answers i'll upload it on the school website you can download it from there on the 1st of june it will be uploaded now let's move on to the book exercise first is objective type questions question number 1 is choose the correct option dash is the first stage in the process of digestion first option is drinking water chewing cooking and swallowing so in the process of digestion first stage is what you know that digestion starts from the mouth only so what will be the correct answer obviously it will be chewing now the next question is which of the following is not a part of the digestive system first one is esophagus second small intestine third kidneys and fourth option is stomach now it is asking which is not a part of digestive system so if you see here esophagus small intestine and stomach these three are parts of digestive system whereas kidney is an organ which participates in the process of excretion so the answer will be kidneys now the next question is in dash water from food gets absorbed and waste called feces is formed first option is large intestine second option is stomach third is small intestine and fourth is anus so it says that food gets absorbed and waste called feces is formed water from food is absorbed and waste called feces is formed so in which part of the digestive system this feces is formed do you remember the answer it is large intestine now the next question is the urine the urine is stored in number 1 urethra second option is kidneys third is anus and fourth is urinary bladder do you remember where urine is stored it is stored in urinary bladder now the next question is dash food assist in easy bowel movement first option is junk junk food second is fat rich food third fiber rich food and fourth option is none of these so for easy bowel movement which will which food will help it is fiber rich food now the next question is choose the correct word to fill in the blank some words are given from which you have to choose the correct answers number 1 question number 1 is the dash system helps the body to digest food and absorb nutrients you see here it is asking for the system 
the system which helps in the process of digestion and absorb nutrients so which system helps in the process of digestion it is the digestive system now the next question is the dash helps to push food into the back of our throat now which part of the digestive system helps in pushing the food into the back of the throat do you remember it is the tongue and at the back of the throat it opens mouth opens into esophagus which is known as food pipe next question is the dash receives juices from liver and pancreas to further break down food now in which part of the digestive system juices from liver and pancreas is released for breakdown of food which part of the digestive system it is carried out it is small intestine next question is the dash system helps the body to get rid of waste that gets formed inside it now if you see it is again asking for the system it is not asking for an organ it is asking for system the system which helps the body to get rid of the waste formed inside our body so the answer will be excretory system now the next question is the urine passes from kidneys to the urinary bladder through thin tubes called now it says that ki thin tubes you have to tell the thin name of the thin tubes which connects the kidneys to the urinary bladder that is arising from the kidneys and opening into urinary bladder so what are the name of these thin tubes it is ureters now the next question is write true and false for each statement now the first question is pancreas is a part of excretory system as you remember excretory system helps to get rid of waste that are formed inside our body whereas pancreas pancreas releases pancreatic juice which helps in the process of digestion so the statement here says that pancreas is a part of excretory system is it right or wrong no it is wrong it is false statement because pancreas is part of digestive system next question is after the mouth food enters the stomach through food pipe or esophagus Uh, we we know that uh, digestion starts from the mouth and from from mouth it opens towards back side into the esophagus and esophagus then opens into stomach so the statement says here after the mouth food enters the stomach through food pipe or esophagus it is true or false it is true now the next question is the waste leaves the body through anus the waste form inside our body known as feces leaves the body through the anus so the statement is true now the next question is urine contains 
toxins present inside our body. So you remember that urine is formed inside the kidneys and it is a harmful substance. It should not be accumulated in our body for long duration. So it is toxic for our body. Here it says that urine contains toxins present inside our body. It is true or false? It is true. Now the next question is fiber rich food is difficult <coughs> to digest. Thus it should not be consumed. So fiber rich food as we have studied earlier that it is undigestible. It does not digest. Okay. But it helps in easy bowel movement. Hence, it is essential to take fiber-rich food. But here the statement says that it should not be consumed. So the statement is false. Next question is, <clears throat> you have to organize the following sentences in correct order by numbering them. Two sentences are given. And you have to arrange them according to their function in our body. Five sentences are given. Now, the first sentence will be, the teeth help us to chew and break down big pieces of food into smaller pieces. This will be the first statement. Next will be the food enters stomach through food pipe or esophagus. This will be the second statement. Third one will be the small intestine works with juices from liver and pancreas to further break down food. This statement will be third. And the fourth statement will be any food that the body doesn't need or can't use is sent to the large intestine. This will be the fourth statement. And the last one will be here water from food gets absorbed and waste called feces is formed. So this will be the last, that is the fifth statement. Now we have completed the book exercise for chapter 3. Now I want to talk to my students. A very pleasant and lovely morning to all my dear students. In this unfortunate circumstances of lockdown, I don't expect you to be at the best of your spirit and happiness, but I do hope that you all are keeping well along with your family. This is an undeniable fact that we are going through tough time, which did not come from any book or any person. It came from life itself. The true fact of life is if you want to see the rainbow, you have to cope up with rain and this rain of fear and difficulties will certainly go and we will see the beautiful rainbow, the beautiful life around us once again. Moreover, when you look back to these days, would you like to remember these days as sad days or as those days that taught you the important lessons of life choice is yours during these days you must have learned to be happy with simple things in life even without luxurious life you can be happy you can learn with limited resources like online classes 
so be sure that lessons which life is teaching will help you surely at every step of your life ahead so students do make best use of your time and evolve a, a better human being you are missing school school is missing you too hope to see you soon take care and have a nice day